Hi there, this is Danny Aon from Aon Events. We are a popular mobile DJ and events business here in San Diego. And what we do is we provide the best and professional DJs and MCs for your next wedding or private event. We are also a full service sound and lighting business, as well as providing premium opener photo booths as well. So today I just wanted to share a little bit on uplighting. You might notice some uplights behind me. Uh, the reason I want to share this is because uplighting is one of the most popular services that couples usually add when booking a wedding. Uh, what I found though is that many couples aren't actually sure what uplighting is or what it does, and most important, importantly, what their options are when choosing uplighting. Uplights are actually wash lights, which are placed on the floor and project a single beam of color towards the ceiling. When placed inside, uplights light up the wall they are placed against as well as the ceiling. Depending on the power of the light itself, that will determine the amount of diffusion and coverage each uplight produces. Uplights are so popular because they can completely change the ambience of a room, giving life to dead rooms and extra bursts of color and excitement to already lively rooms. Also, uplights look really great in photos. The size of your venue will play a part in deciding how many uplights are right for your wedding or event. You can order any number of uplights, but when we typically set up uplighting, it's either 8, 10, 12, 14, or 16 fixtures. For some of our bigger corporate clients and large military balls, we may go as high as 24 uplights, but the average for weddings is usually 8, 12, or 16. All uplight fixtures are definitely not created the same. There's a lot of variation in quality and price with uplights, but most professional DJs and production companies should have the latest versions. The newest models from Eternal, Blizzard, and Chauvet are all wireless, so there's no cables anymore. And most of them are RGBAWUV, which means they can faithfully, faithfully reproduce all the colors in the spectrum. RGBAWUV refers to the six base colors the lights use in order to generate all the amazing tones that we see. Older style uplights only used RGB, which is red, green, and blue as their base, so they had troubles with colors like ambers and whites, as well as the pastels and off-white tones. The uplights that we use are also remote controlled, so we can change all the lights at the same time for different parts of the event. For example, one tone during the dinner, another tone during the toast, and an often, an often sound activated for the dancing. Our wedding tip is that you should definitely consider adding uplighting to your wedding. It looks amazing and it totally transforms the way a room looks. And for those reasons, we definitely can't recommend it strongly enough. Hope you found this video helpful. If uh, you have any questions about uplighting or any other type of lighting, please just let me know. Um, I want to thank you for watching and I hope everyone is staying safe and well.